ये लोकतांत्रिक मूल्यों में विश्वास करने वाले विश्व के लिए एक बहुत ही शुभ संकेत है भारत अमेरिका बहुत ही घनिष्ठ मित्र हैं और मूल्यों के आधार पर हमारी मित्रता हमेशा आगे बढ़ती चली जा रही है जहां तक ट्रेड का सवाल है मुझे खुशी है कि मैं जब परसों ह्यूस्टन में था तो हमारे पेट्रोनेट ने वहां पर 2.5 बिलियन डॉलर के इन्वेस्टमेंट के साथ एनर्जी सेक्टर में इन्वेस्टमेंट का एम किया है और उसका परिणाम ये होगा कि आने वाले कुछ दशक में करीब 60 बिलियन डॉलर का ट्रेड और करीब पचास हजार लोगों के लिए जॉब तो अपने आप में एक बहुत बड़ा इनिशिएटिव भारत ने लिया है राष्ट्रपति ट्रंप मेरे तो मित्र है ही है लेकिन भारत के बहुत एक अच्छे मित्र के रूप में आज भारत और अमेरिका बहुत तेजी से आगे बढ़ रहे हैं और मैं राष्ट्रपति ट्रंप का फिर से एक बार धन्यवाद करता हूँ First of all, I would like to uh, express my gratitude uh, to President Trump uh, that uh, he was uh, with me in uh, Houston uh, day before yesterday. Uh, he took out time from his busy schedule to go to Houston, and uh, he spent a lot of time with us. And I think for uh, the Indian community, people of Indian origin in the United States, this was an occasion of great pride. And uh, for this, once again, let me thank uh, President Trump from the bottom of my heart. Uh, after the formation of uh, the new government, we haven't even completed four months. But during this period of time, I've had the occasion to uh, meet President Trump three times now, and we've had uh, very uh, detailed and fruitful discussions on many issues. Uh, in the world, between the oldest and the largest democracy, this kind of nearness, uh, this relationship of ease, and this continuous engagement. I think uh, countries coming together which uh, believe in democratic values, I think that's a very good sign for the world. Uh, for uh, India and the United States, uh, not only are we very close friends, but this is a friendship that is based on values and uh, this will continue to uh, strengthen in the times to come. As far as trade is concerned, I'm very happy that uh, day before yesterday in Houston, uh, in uh, my presence, there was an agreement signed by the Indian company Petronet for uh, an amount of $2.5 billion, which uh, is the amount of investment that the Indian company is going to do in the energy sector. And this will mean that in the years to come, in the decades to come, this will result in trade of uh, an amount of $60 billion and create 50,000 jobs which I think is a very big initiative taken by India. President Trump is definitely my friend, but he is also a friend of India. And uh, relations between India and the United States are proceeding at a very uh, good and fast pace. Once again, let me thank President Trump. Mr. President, you mentioned uh, President Trump, you mentioned trade. Uh, you, and uh, Prime Minister Modi had during the Houston event said that you know the art of the deal. Can we expect something as a, on a trade deal uh, in, in talks today uh, or what the U.S. and India can do together to boost trade ties going forward? Well, I think very soon. We're doing very well. And Bob Lighthizer, who's right here, is negotiating with India and their very capable representatives. And I think uh, very soon we'll have a trade deal. Uh, we'll have the larger deal down the road a little bit, but we will have a trade deal very soon. Mr. Trump, in Houston, you said. Mr. Trump, in Houston, you said about. You've been talking about, you know, clamping down on terrorism from across the globe. Pakistan has been the global epicenter of terrorism, sir. You spoke about it in Houston. How do you make sure that you clamp down on terrorism from Pakistan because that is uh, posing threat to democracies like the U.S. and India? Even the business interests suffer because of continuing terrorism. Well, I had a very good meeting with Prime Minister Khan. Uh, it's a long meeting, and we discussed a lot. And I think he'd like to see something happen that would be very fruitful, very peaceful. And I think that will happen, ultimately. I really believe that these two great gentlemen will get together and work something. 
Uh, I also, uh, you know, you, you mentioned Pakistan, but Iran would have to be at the top of the list because if you look at terrorist states, that's been the number one for a long time. But I really believe that Prime Minister Modi and Prime Minister Khan, they get along, they will get along when they get to know each other, and I think a lot of good things will come from that meeting. Well, President, 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 you are, President, 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 President,